there have been so many changes to Harry's team. I mean, is our national security still safe in their hands? Who is there left to rely on now that Danny's dead, Zoe's fled, and Tom... Do we even remember Tom? It's Tom. Buzzing. He's a good guy. I think he believes very much in his job. Um, he's very serious about him, about his job. I love you. And so the conflict arises when, as with a lot of the characters, he tries to balance his work life with his domestic life and his personal relationships. The contradictions are just too much for Tom, and in the end, he has to go. Professor Roberts, can you go with these officers? He's please? not going anywhere! Professor! I'm collecting his family and I'm taking them to safety. What's the matter with you, Tom? What's the matter with me? I've woken up to this job! I think he kind of falls out of love with it and uh, wants his life back, <laughs> wants a bit of kind of reality and normality. I'm decommissioning you, Tom. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Harry. You are no longer an officer of the service. Danny, Zoe, come on! It was really sad when Matthew left because it was kind of the beginning of the end for us as a, as a, uh, as a group, you know, the group that started out. It was the end of an era. Um, it was very easy to get upset. Um, and I think it sort of was literally one of his last scenes as well. You know, it's not like we shot it at the beginning and it all forgotten, you know, we were all gearing up for him to go. And it, it was very sad, yeah. I'm sure Tom could have gone on and on and on, but it's kind of a perfect ending, uh, for me, anyway. 18 hours of one of Tom Quinn is enough. 